We're at the grave of Elizabeth Roberts. Though you will see that the name Medill was here, and that is because later on Elizabeth will remarry. But our story is really focused on her when she lost her husband, Mr. Robert. To get over the loss of her husband, her, her niece, and three servants had booked a tour through Europe. And it is at the point in time they decide to come back to America and booked passage on the Titanic that Elizabeth's story becomes, of course, something of an international sensation. She, the niece, and the three servants are some of the first people off the Titanic, but one of the last lifeboats picked up by the Carpathia. And when Elizabeth was boarding the Carpathia, she had seen and noticed another St. Louis and Catherine Hurd. And it's the combination of the story of Catherine Hurd and Elizabeth Roberts that will give us one of the very first hand accounts of the sinking of the Titanic. On a regular basis, the Titanic Society will come out and lay a wreath at the final resting place of Elizabeth Roberts here at the Medill family lot with on the grounds of Bellefontaine Cemetery in Arboretum at 4947 West Forest.